Because those damage that's damage after soak. Which can rip apart a person. Sure can. Yeah, I deal one damage. No, I'm gonna spend a destiny point to add my agility to the damage. What's All your right. agility? Five? Alright, I can't hit you with the vibro knucklers because that would like actually deal like normal damage. It has to be stun damage. Uh, oh come on, I thought this was seeing who could who would win in an actual It's fight. a robot, he can be rebuilt. <laughs> yeah, I have yeah, as long as you don't, don't destroy the Robo Brain. Well, I mean, if that's the argument that you're gonna make, okay, let me close out of the, just the, the normal Wookie Fu <laughs> attack. We paid to see actual combat. That's. Let's see. Let's see. I was actually damaged, so that would be an extra point of damage on top of that. No, I know. That's only suffered wounds, not strain. So that would be nine damage, which is reduced by your soak to four. And then, right. and, then, and then the GM like spins. Oh no, I have uh, I have pierce, so that would be five damage. Mm -hmm. And then okay. like with this, with like, I don't know, with the with the fucking threat threat. I, that's how that's how the GM spins that. I can't spin that. So five, five, five wounds. Oh, wounds. Yeah, five wounds. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna. Go ahead and just slap an emergency repair patch on that. Hey, no interfering. <laughs> no interfering right now. Uh, this is mono a droido. No, I'm gonna have to fix that. Shit. <laughs> Let me go ahead okay. and I didn't modify how. What's the goes. role to disengage? It's just a disengage check. <laughs> I don't know what it is though. It's just a melee move. It's just is a maneuver. It? You just you spend a maneuver to move away. Okay, then I spend a maneuver to move away and then shoot. Yeah. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I should actually... I have just! What is it, Schnell? Schnell? I think when you maneuver... Schnell is you faster. Maneuver, a maneuver it will only move you out of your current range band, though, into the next range band. It won't move you any further unless you spend two maneuvers. Okay, or so move from engage to short. Yeah. I'm not even... You miss... <laughs> <gasps> wow! You generate two. You generate two advantages, though. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't use it to recover strain. That would give you a free maneuver if you, but you already used two maneuvers. So, yeah. no, you didn't, because you, you just moved once and then shot. You could like use those two advantages to get a free maneuver again. That wouldn't cost you strain. And then keep running. So instead, you, instead <laughs> of like running. a short, you could like move to medium. So I have to spend two maneuvers catching up to you, which means I have to take extra strain in order to catch you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I use that shot suppressive fire to get even more distance. All right, let me go ahead and take this two fucking strain. <laughs> 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 fucking like try and catch you. So <laughs> when I catch you, and then I'll try to hit you. <laughs> this is dumb. Shit, I missed! Alright, I recovered three strain with my amazing. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's really funny. <laughs> fucking missed, too. This is so stupid. Oh, that's <laughs> so funny. Alright, it's your turn, Eric. <laughs> I don't even have to tell the story. We're gonna make Grimoth rage quit before the game even starts. <laughs> Alright, disengage again and then shoot again. Alright. That's just what he does. That's right. You don't want to be in melee. Oh, just run away from the Wookie. Ooh, that's uh, that's thirteen reduced by my soak, which is seven. That's enough to knock me out. James, <laughs> the Wookie's <laughs> running, screaming, having the <laughs> having the strain just sort of pour off with the adrenaline, and then pow! It's like, how did I miss that? Slave. <laughs> Down goes the Wookie. It's like Jake, they know not to target my wounds. <laughs> they know. They know. <laughs> <laughs> fucking, <laughs> fucking hot deception. <laughs> Who is he targeting with the two difficulty? It's Who just, cares? It's generally two difficulty unless it's harder. Well, if it's targeting, is it against their cool? It would be, like, uh, against, like, their actual, like thing like you would have like difficulty and challenge dice on that mm -hmm. situation yeah I think cool is the one used to resist social it's okay stuff. It, it's not it's not difficult to fool me I'm like okay 
Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, I, is there anybody here with two willpower? No, one other than me. You're the only one I think to have. Uh, oh no, I actually was thinking of cool, not willpower. Yeah, I'm about to say I don't even have. Which is based on presence. So not I guess like, there would be a lot of people. Well, I have, I have, I have discipline. So if he attempted to coerce me, then then I might have that. Ooh, ooh, fancy. Yeah. It, yeah, I I run enough things for you guys to do. <laughs> we're mostly you, just playing around with the framework. You, right now. you, you made a note of that for yeah, me. We're, well, we're it, familiarizing it, ourselves. Yeah, it's good. It's good to learn the framework and how. Uh, how it's a good thing that no one knows to knock the Wookiee unconscious instead of just trying to kill him, right? No one knows that, or else they would have pursued that angle a long time ago. I imagine typically, unless they were, like, disciplined soldiers, they might just open fire with whatever they have. That's right. It's kind of a scary sight seeing a Wookiee bearing down on you. And that's what I want them to do. I want them to hurt me. (laughs) Hurt me more. That's the best part. I want you to hurt me. I even want you to critically hit me. (laughs) So long as it's a You're a space masochist. The more you try to so, strike me down will only make me stronger. Seven times down, eight times up. Mm-hmm. So to actually repair uh, Jay without the use of a uh, emergency patch, it would be scrap and the toolkit, yeah? It would like be a mechanics, mechanics check. check. Instead yeah. of like a medicine check, it would be a mechanics check, yes. Right. Well, they would make a mechanics check. Mm-hmm. What's the difficulty of his thing? One, two, two, I don't know. It's generally two depending on the severity of the injuries. Oh. It'll be two unless it'll be two. It's generally two. I'm just gonna. <laughs> it'll be easier like if you have like an actual workshop and you have like easy. You have no one bearing That's down it. on you. One. That's right. All right. I'll be back at you tomorrow, Jay. That's when I recover all of my strength. <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> I'll try this again. And Jay's still like, no, my arm is still missing. <laughs> Just try a mechanics check and then slap an emergency on top. That's of what it. I need to do. I need enough triumphs to just disable his blaster arm. There we go. That would yeah. be it. <laughs> that would be it. Yeah. Or add some, or somehow add ion damage to your fibro knuckles. I don't know how you pull that <laughs> off, but whatever. It's Star Wars. I, I, I coat the vibro knucklers in ion. <laughs> it's Star Wars. You could probably pick it. You could probably work it out. Yes. Yes. Does it feel like the focusing shit from a lightsaber and have it focus a blade of ion because around Because it's your knuckles. not like those crystals are illicit or anything <laughs> in this galaxy right now. Well, you, you wouldn't need the crystals, just the focusing and alignment stuff. The crystal sure. creates plasma. You don't want that. <laughs> well, aren't ion, yes. aren't ion blasters just missing one chamber from a normal blaster? Uh, like one focusing that's, chamber? That's going further than my knowledge. I don't know. Cool. Nice talk. Good talk. Time to (laughs) modify a weapon. Yeah. Ionization blaster would be the great way to keep you in line. (laughs) Or it would. (laughs) Wait until he powers down to do something and slap her. And then just don't power him back on. That's right. (laughs) <laughs> There's lots of really easy ways to deal with J3PO. No, 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 getting you in your sleep, that's just, that that's thats unprofessional. He plugs in and powers down to recharge. You just walk by and casually trip over the cord. I yank okay. out the cord, like, ball it up. <laughs> oh, by the way, there is this, there's this section in the uh, character creation I think everyone looks over. Characters keep any unspent credits, they... they when they start the game. In addition, once the player has finalized spending his credits, he rolls 1d100. His character gains as many additional credits as pocket money at the beginning of the game. You're right, oh. Mike. And none of us fucking caught that. So you can actually fucking start... Fucking hell. 11. <laughs> you have 11. So I, <laughs> I guess I'm the rich one here. <laughs> <Dang. laughs> That's fucking awesome, Chris. We did it. Aaron, roll. We, like, we, nice, not only uh, did we get the same result, we both got lower. <laughs> well, hey, if we were playing like some sort of system that required you to get low on a 1D100, we'd be golden. Like uh, We all failed pretty badly on this one. Mm-hmm. All right, 10 extra oh, credits. Oh, 10 extra credits to whatever you have left over. All right, I'm up to 14. All right, I'm up to, I'm up to 60. Hey. I'm up to 33. I'm swinging spending cash around. I think I got like 700. Let me check my sheet. What? Yeah. Oh, my okay. sheet didn't cost much. Right. I went full Monty of uh, getting the 3K from the 10 obligation. Did you? <laughs> yeah. 
well, the two point five k plus the five hundred and plenty of other things to buy if you're looking. Oh, for I can buy all the stupid shit. All the stupid shit. That's the spirit. We're gonna have to leave her behind because she's so over encumbered with stupid shit. No, no. Once we have a ship, the stupid shit goes in the ship. We have to get to the ship first. I'm also, not also yet. Also, Jay has a carrying compartment. Exactly. Just put it in the robot. Yeah, but that doesn't that doesn't improve your encumbrance, does it? Yeah, it actually does. It's his backpack. Oh, that counts as his backpack. Got it's it. an implanted backpack. That is. That is a thing. <laughs> <laughs> I, everything I read online is like, well, the first thing... Yeah, people... droids, a, a lot of basic gear, droids can just count as part of their body. Sure, sure. Yeah. And that's actually what the strap around you is for. You, like, move that, and that's, like, that's the carrying compartment. Yes, a, sure. back, yes a, a droid compartment full of cortex bombs. Exactly. You'll, no one will ever see it coming. Does that mean the compartment is actually where his brain should be? Probably. No, it's, you know that bulge thing that uh, droids have on their back? The protocol droids. No, I don't. Not really? <laughs> okay, got like a oh, big the kind of square thing? thing? No, yeah, that's a trooper. I, I don't nope, know about I don't know. droid bulges. Mm. Well, you're gonna. I'm not a robophile here, man. Anyways, one of the things I was reading online about character creation was the most, some of the most important things to buy for a character is a utility belt and a backpack. Because they increase your encumbrance together by, like, six. Sure, I'll, 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 I'll I'll might, I, I might increase encumbrance later once I actually need to increase my encumbrance. Yeah, Aaron I'm, needed it. You backpack. Everyone will be bought backpack. Backpacks right. right. Here we go. No, I'm not going to wear a backpack. What kind of fucking Star Wars person wears those? They don't wear them in the movies. <laughs> that boxy thing on his back panel is uh, where it opens up to the compartment. I see. Okay. Man, it's like it doesn't look very you're big. You're replacing well, no, no. most of his chest cavity is the storage compartment. That's just where it opens. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Can three PO arms even reach in there? His he has He has agility four. He isn't using entirely standard parts. He has so many joints, you don't even know, Ryan. <laughs> See this arm? It has 12 points of articulation. That is some weirdly sensual shit. In other words, <laughs> that's amazing! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's uh, weirdly specific there. <laughs> 12, huh? Wow. A whole hey, your arm. A whole 12. You know, J3PO has some pretty nice soak value on him, too. Yeah. Don't. What is it? Droids start at three. Uh, I thought it was brawn two plus droids get an extra one for being droids. Oh yeah, you also. As have... well as his. Uh, yeah, he's wearing armor. His paneling is tougher than usual. Okay. He bought armor. Yes, it's got yeah. the equivalent of padded armor built into it. Yes, I I'm wearing my heavy clothes. Ragjar's wearing clothes. That way, I can get my medal. Cause I got pants. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta put the metal right on your pants. <laughs> Just make it my belt buckle. That's yeah. not the awkward. I'm a hero. Off. How you doing? <laughs> How you doing? Just to, just attract all the ladies' attention to my bling. Dick. Yeah, you know, you, you got your hands on your hips. You got, <laughs> you got your groin <laughs> stuck out a little bit. <laughs> just keep nodding down your belt buckle. Oh, he has a it. ceremonial award cod piece. As, as I step onto the squared floor and begin to, like, do a hoe down. <laughs> yes. How you doing? That's amazing. <laughs> oh, man. Let's oh. Let's but yeah, the great thing about droids is that they can lose limbs for comedy value. You could have been a Trandoshan for that, too. They could regrow their limbs. I can lose limbs funny. for comedy value. <laughs> yeah, I can lose limbs for comedy value, too. <laughs> Except it'll be more funny when it happens to us. Except to find a good surgeon and a mechanic, and we can put new limbs on it. Yeah, cybernetics are a thing. Yep. Yes. Then I can fix you, too. Mm, I can fix cool. you. I'd rather not be beholden. <laughs> <laughs> you would never be that. 
I, I, I don't want ionization ion blasters to be able to work on me when they target me. No, my legs! I can't walk! <laughs> My lips, just, my have, just have uh, this, this, this Wookiee like digging its claws through like the the ground as it just like crawls forward towards the enemy. All he has is one arm left. He refuses to get cybernetics because he only has nine strain. I will defeat you. Mm -hmm. Oh man! Okay. Yeah, the unfortunate thing is, I've slaved your cybernetic legs to my data pad. Let's go. No. Damn. That's Clever. not how that works. It's I have a firewall. <laughs> not after I got done with them. That's why I didn't have you work on them. Uh, that's what you're saying. The Jay, I think I'd yeah. rather have I think I'd rather have an actual medical person apply cybernetics to a living person. No yes. shit. Yeah. Hey, don't worry, I got this. No, no, that's why I'm spending the thousands and thousands of credits. <laughs> no, it'll be fine, don't worry. I'm not worrying. <laughs> no, that'll go away. It did have be to be this way. Because I went to a trained person, I'm not worried. <laughs> exactly. Brian and I are on the same page here. Hmm. And also, if we have to do any sort of, like, wilderness thing, if we're on, like, a jungle planet, or if we need to, like, track down people, I'm your Wookiee. Oh, come on. A Wookiee's just a droid made out of meat. Right? I think it's the other way around. Yeah. You're a metal Wookiee. That's so <laughs> metal. That's amazing. I accept. It's <laughs> <That's> amazing. <laughs> I'm going to carry you on my back and slowly repair you. I don't have any mechanic skill. Just my ability <laughs> dice. He's going to learn one arm at a time. That's right. This wire See, went now, here, right? Now that's the ultimate battle formation. J-3PO sitting on a uh, rock like charm's style. shoulders. Shooting while he goes fucking mental. There we go, like... Oh, oh, the Wookiee turned his back. He's going to run away. What the fuck is that? <laughs> New battle formation. Turtle style. What? <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. Beats me, guys. I don't know. Did you say O because you realized you were muted? Hmm? Did you say O because you realized you were muted? No. Okay. I've been quiet this whole time. Right, he's been so amazed by his dapper hut. <laughs> That's what I've been calling him ever him. since he showed it to us. I, dapper the hut. I did. I don't recall seeing that. That is that is definitely an experience. If Florida really does look that dapper, it's no wonder that we agreed to pay him the credits we owed him <laughs> and didn't realize until we were so far away. Wait a fucking second. We didn't know him shit. <laughs> I have a feeling it's because we were standing there with a bunch of guards all around. <laughs> we didn't land on Sherwood Forest. <laughs> Sherwood Forest landed on us. <sighs> yeah, I'm pretty sure that's something somebody with no ranks in education would say. <laughs> yep. I have a rank in education. Good for you. Jay doesn't. We're a bunch of uneducated bastards. Mm -hmm. Yes. I didn't, I didn't have the opportunity to become learned about the galaxy. Hey, he I, was... I didn't have the experience to learn anything. He's not a bad robot. He was just drawn that way. He was built this way. Right. Literally. And, uh, and, and coming to the idea, I think... Uh, I think the smuggler can help steer what contracts we take along with the Game Master, so if there's something she finds heinous, then she doesn't have to, like, you know, I don't want to negotiate for that one. I'm like, all right, Jay, it's up to you. You need to talk to them about it. <laughs> can do. He opens fire. Good, negoti good negotiations can get you more money, among yeah. other things. Right, right, I got you. I'll talk to them. And then he pronounces a wink while turning off one of his eye lights. Wink. Get that droid out of here. Tell that, me that, it's that, blaster negotiation. That, that's right. That, that, that's right. You know, 
You know, aliens might be second and third and fourth class citizens or dead, but droids? You're going to be in a galaxy full of people who don't even value droids. You're just a thing. We own you. The upside is that no one pays him much attention. Well, in his psychedelic outfit. Yeah. He might catch A little bit more in that case. There there might be a lot of, what the hell's wrong with your droid? He looks like a particularly shitty 3PO protocol droid. Hey, hey. It's my 3PO. Particularly shitty. Particularly conspicuous. Hey, hey. Hey. Could that face kill somebody? I mean, look at it. Hey, real boats rock. If he looked too perfect, then you'd know something was wrong. But there's also a difference between not looking too perfect and looking too (laughs) wrong. (laughs) Damn it. Like I said, he's eventually going to get a paint job. He's so wrong looking that people just don't notice him just to prevent any problem to themselves. I got your paint job right here. What are you offering your blood? <laughs> Is it blued? <laughs> blued? <laughs> Silly protocol droid. So do I call you Jay? Is that, that Jay. what Jay prefers to be known called as Jay? Sure. It, 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 it's hard to take that seriously while staring into those soulless fucking multicolored <laughs> eyes. I take that real seriously. I mean, like I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, zo- I'm, zo- I'm zooming in on like that portrait right now. And that looks, yeah, the deeper you go, the worse it looks. <laughs> Genth. That's amazing. That's yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Oh, half, yeah. this, half this stuff doesn't even write itself. I could just let you guys go off. What does this safe. thing on your back do? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't open. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> and my whiskey, too. God damn. Oh, that, that was the that's, whiskey. That's where all of the thermal grenades are kept. Uh, I wa- that was the whiskey. Besides the whiskey. The oh, whiskey oh, that would be boom. like, we're experiencing some turbulence. Just like slowly run towards Jay. No. <laughs> <laughs> Jay like starts like falling down like a cliffside. Don't get him! <laughs> Let him fall. <laughs> but I, I I need to like try. No, no, don't get him. But I can like grab him. No, let him fall. Hmm. Is there a specific mod that I could get to make his head and verbo brain particularly resilient? Mod? No. Okay. We can encase it in the equivalent of robo bandages. I mean, there's the cyber, the cybernetic enhancement that gives you plus one soak value. That's the only thing I can think of, and that costs like four thousand credits, I think. Mm-hmm. No, I, I just mean something that would make it so that uh, he's much more likely to, even if he gets quote unquote killed, to have his head remain intact. That's way too specific for this game, Aaron. For rebuilding. No, no. If your character is counted as killed, then it's assumed that your central processing unit's destroyed. Yeah. Damn it. That's that's engraved into the rules. You're not you're not just because you're not because you're a droid. You're more likely to survive. It's, you can just Actually, it's, you you are, but that's already given to you in the free soak. Yeah. Uh, yes. It's just more likely if this is more likely when you take critical hits that some of your arms may, some parts may fall off. That's right. That's just hilarious. Yeah, not not just I have your, to put the goddamn thing back up. Not God just damn. your free soak with the fact that you don't need to eat, sleep, or breathe. Yeah. You, you have don't advantages want... that people would pay thousands of gold pieces and magic items for, man. You know what? I'm not putting up with this shit anymore. I'm going outside of the ship for a while. Okay. We just like jump to hyperspace and before he can like attach the cord, it's like he's left dangling there in space. (laughs) I regret. I didn't think this through. (laughs) I regret everything. Uh, Oh, well, that's a thing I could try and give him a grappling hook launcher. Are you going to try to grapple to a ship that's or, entering or, or, or like space? Yeah. Or maybe like a distress beacon that you can activate so that someone like Jawas would like come pick you up. <laughs> the uh, Java Mafia will never, never. Can you use a comlink as a uh, distress beacon? No. 
It doesn't have enough power to go that far. You, it, it, the Home Lakes can barely reach across like portions of a planet, Aaron. Extrapolate that distance. Extrapolate the distance in space, Aaron. Space. Yeah. Space. Space is big. Even, even the final portions frontier. of a planet sounds a bit. Yeah. Long. Comlinks can only reach like other par other comlinks and like facilities because they have routing things. Like routing things. things. I don't know. Like that was such a scientific term. I don't know things. stuff. <laughs> like stuff that routes your comlink call to someone else. I don't know. Shit. What do I look like? A GM? Oh wait. Yeah, he has a hollow net transmitter. <laughs> like that thing that costs hundreds of thousands of credits. <laughs> yeah. yeah the, the handheld ones I know can reach low orbit and maybe like fifty kilometers. <gasps> yeah, but in space, good luck. Oh, yeah. You have to have yet to have a starship end up coming with like was it a hundred. They basically have to run you over to pick you up. Yeah. So that would be like, why did our starship suddenly stop in the trade lane? They're like looking around for an asteroid. <laughs> this, this, this little droid like Help! floating in the middle. <laughs> Help! They pull up close enough for the grappling hook. That was their first mistake. <laughs> and their only mistake. It's, <laughs> and then you like a uh, no no no. They first, stopped. You know, that was their first mistake. Their second mistake was pulling up close enough for the grappling hook. You going. fucking hide on them worse than the Millennium Falcon did on <laughs> shit. <laughs> they don't get a strike three. Rainbow hued protocol drive just running through the vents killing people. Yes? Write that down. <laughs> <laughs> you kill like a crew of 1200 and the ship is just sitting there derelict for anyone else. Like They stop their hyperspace jump because they have to because it's the middle of the trade line. They're like why is there a ship just sitting here? Pirates? Actually, you amass this graveyard of ships. <laughs> <laughs> a ship graveyard, and he's the only sentient thing in it. It, it won't be sentient for long. Just grappling hook from vessel to vessel. Of derelict ships back home. That's so good. I'm glad you guys like the idea of a, of a ship graveyard, though. Oh, they exist. Oh, they exist. Okay, I can't find a grappling hook launcher. Delt, that sucks for you, nerd. It, it does. In another book. It actually does suck for me. It might exist in another book. I'm well, there when his fantasy, he'll like need to like turn on like some Magna Boots or whatever to achieve the same effect. Or yes, da -da -da. Magna Boots. Magna yeah, boots. I can't find Magna Boots either. Are you even looking in the other books, Aaron? I'm looking in the gear section of the character generator. Oh. Yeah. So, yes. Is there anything else we wanted to bring up as it pertains to the Edge of the Empire? I can't think of anything unless you guys got stuff. Um, on a scale of one to punch, how punched is the first mook we find? Chris? That depends on whether or not how how far away it is. That that's really a, that's punched. an important that's an important distinction because if it's too far away for me to punch it, mm -hmm. then Jay should totally just shoot it. Yeah, Jay will probably shoot it first if it's not in punching range. <laughs> it's kind of his thing. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna send the server off right now because I don't think I think we're done playing with framework for now. All right, we're so uh, so when's gonna be our first session of this? Uh, looking towards next Monday, but you know, yeah, it's gonna be next Monday at this rate. Okay. I have I've had things planned out for a while. I just needed you know, for all flesh must be eaten to actually you know end. It, hey, hey, I kept telling you, man. like, every session for the past four sessions that next week all <laughs> Edge of the Empire could begin. <laughs> Actually, yeah. is there a grappling hook built into the utility belt? Maybe. Well, like Goonies with Data using, like, his little... <laughs> no, that's where, the, that's where the grappling hook was in, uh, in uh, New Hope. Mm-hmm. That's what uh, Luke had. Because they just fucking had a grappling hook, apparently. 